What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Miles Well. And what we're going to be doing today is discussing a challenge. And yo, listen, this game right here, I didn't even want it to turn out like this, but the dudes in my streams are just outrageous savages. And um, this dude came out, and um, he was one of the typical opponents that when you're playing him, you could just imagine that he doesn't have eyeballs, eyelids, fingertips. You know what I'm saying? He doesn't have toenails. Like, it, the game is designed for the weirdest dudes to just beat, like, just beat you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, regardless of what it is, some of you guys think it's DDA. I've tried to make it very, very clear that every video game that I probably ever played has DDA in it. Um, dynamic difficulty adjustment is just something that's in the game. Pretty much um, with Madden, it's it, it, it's not even about getting the best team anymore because the players don't even do what they say that they do as far as attributes go, to be honest. So sometimes the fluke is going to be wild, but I got videos here way back, Madden 12, 13, when, you know, 25, when the game was decent, um, and fluke happens. It's, it's Madden. It's just that the fluke happens a little bit more uh, in Madden 18, 16, and 17, so people are, you know, just looking for a reason to be wild. But all in all, you're going to still sometimes play guys. Oh, okay, you're going to just throw it right through my face? All right, cool. You're going to still play guys that you, you're going you're gonna to say to yourself, like, how is this guy breathing? You know what I'm saying? Because he's such an idiot. But he still comes out and does whatever he wants to do. So your job and, and, and my job as, you know, as a guy that commentates Madden for you guys in this uh, particular situation is to make you guys understand you're not in a different boat than anybody else. Everybody that plays Madden deals with guys that come out with no scheme, that just press plays. They ask Madden for what play. That's what happens, and that's what the game has been designed to do. Okay? So... When you get a guy like this that comes out and he has no self-respect and he's just coming out with the full intent to make you rage uncontrollably, you have to do what's necessary in order to make him understand that you hate him and everybody else that plays the game like him. You know what I'm saying? But then after the game, it's always good game regardless. You know what I'm saying? Like Madden makes you hate your opponent just because the game is bad and he'll do something. Like you'll be in the perfect defense, right? Like throughout this game, I know you just saw when he threw the ball right to the flat. And I had Lattimore in a flat, and he just throws it right through Lattimore's body, and it's an incomplete pass. And then he does things like this. He's right in field goal range, and he's such an idiot that he kicks the ball short. You see, things like that is what gets people very, very infuriated. And EA doesn't understand that that's why their video game makes people want to fly to Antarctica first class and line up baby seals, bro. Like, it's very, very simple. This is the holy thing, right? The game is so wild and ridiculous that you may come out and you may play a toddler, like what what a toddler age is, like two to three. Like those are the that's who you lose to now in this game. Like th this is this guy's read. His read is really right there. You might look at it and say to yourself, it's no way that guy thinks that he's gonna catch that. Bruh, go you you have no idea. You know, and that's the funny thing about a lot of the guys that they leave comments like, yeah, bro, you know, it's not even that bad. You know, the dude is not really throwing in the coverage. Are you serious? Like, bro, are, are you guys really serious? And by the way, shout out to GS, and um, I think it was like a couple other people that helped fill that um, that donation for the Madden bundle. I already opened one in a previous video, but this is footage from before because you guys were asking me about the blowout. And by the way, I want you guys uh, to please pause the video and guess if I'm going to score 100 on this guy. For the guys that were already in the stream, don't cheat, bro, and leave it in the comments. You know what I'm saying? But this, go this game is going to really get hot and spicy really, really quickly. Um, but anyway... Getting back to the actual thing with these guys, right? There's a lot of things that are wrong with Madden 18. But all in all, you can't complain about everything. For instance, I like a lot of the Mutt promos that have gone on this year. So whenever something is good, I'm going to talk good about it. If it's bad, I'm going to talk bad about it. It's, it's, it's a balance of it. You can't, you're not going to like everything simply because what's going to happen is you're going to play a game in which your brain cells are going to stop working because you're not going to believe that a guy's going to throw the ball in the quadruple coverage every play and dot you. See, that's what really gets me crazy. And, um, you know, oh, he's just going to throw a screenplay? Nine out of ten times, I'll drop that, though. And then EA will say, oh, yeah, you were holding Y, you were holding triangle. No, we're not. Like, bro, I, I, you know what it is? I have to get, I'm going to get a camera to, like, show the remote like, and just let you guys see. I'm pressing the button as soon as the ball is released. And I tell you guys, I was holding Y after I figured, yo, pick that. Chan Bailey, take that for six, too. He got the pick six cam. Take that for six. Take that for, yeah, take, yeah, yeah, yeah. For six, though. For six, though. Um, in Madden 17, once I figured out that you could hold Y or triangle, whatever, I told you guys I was doing it. I have no reason to lie to you guys. But once they told me this year that you can't do it, it took me like 
maybe like like three or four weeks, bro. Because like you know when your brain is just set on doing something, I admitted it. And if you look at my earlier videos, I admitted when I was holding Y triangle. But now I just roam around holding the left analog stick, bro. And I wait until the ball is thrown. And I still drop user picks. So whatever they did, uh, I expected it because it's not like EA is going to make a perfect science for you to be able to intercept the ball because they want to make the game more frustrating. They want you to not like your opponent. And then they want to make fun of you on a competitive, uh, you know, on a competitive stage when you're raging uncontrollably and then you can't control your bowels after the game. Well, I don't know if that's true. I just added that in there for more dramatic effect. But if you can't control your bowels, you got to go see a doctor. But listen, I'm just saying, you, you get so upset that you just don't care anymore. And then before you know it, you're booking a first class flight to Antarctica and you're trying to line up baby seals, bro, and do what you got to do to them, bro, because you're so angry about what EA is doing. Did I just throw that pit? Yeah, that was a Stevie. But that was a Stevie straight up. But again, this guy right here, obviously he's down 38 zip. So the dude has no conscience, all right? So he doesn't really care about much. Dude's coming out, still snapping the ball, still getting sacked. We already know that this game is won. So what happens is at this point, he, oh, I thought he caught that. At this point, the stream just wanted me to do whatever. Like, bro, we're going to go for 100. First was like, yo, let's go for a 50 burger. Then the stream gets, you know, you guys get greedy. Like, yo, let me go for more. And my subs on Twitch are just outrageous animals. So that's what they want to do. They just want more blood, bro. They're like, listen, let's keep on doing it. Let yo try to get a hundred. So you can see it's the third quarter, and the way that this guy is playing, why wouldn't you try to go for a hundred on the guy? Like he's going for it on fourth and nine. And you guys might think that this is regular, yo, this is unusual behavior. I wanted to say, not usual, unusual behavior. But this is this is very, very regular. The way that this guy is playing right now, this is actually very, very regular for Madden 18. And let me tell you something. With all the stuff that he's doing. Most of the time, I would be losing right now. It would be like a 17-14 game. He would be up by three with the same reads. All the stuff that this guy's doing right now, everything that he's doing, it looks like it's weird and it's not supposed to happen. These are 100% the same exact things that happen in actual games. When I'm losing, getting blown out, dude just beating the Like, it's really, really bad. And you know what's funny about it? Even the really, uh, quote-unquote, good players that think they're really, really raw, this is... They do these same things. They throw the ball in the coverage. I drop picks. Like, all kinds of craziness happens. It's the same exact thing. Only thing that's different is that EA just didn't care about this guy. This guy probably didn't buy enough packs. He didn't do something he's supposed to do. Like, he was probably spending, like, $50 a day in packs, and he missed the day. And he was like, all right, we got you. It's going to happen like this. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be punished for not doing what you got to do. But at the end of the day, understand, this is completely normal behavior. The way that this guy is playing is completely rational in his mind. The only problem is he doesn't have a brain. And then the, you know, it's the same um, system of guys and players that we play. And that's why when I start a stream, and I told you guys, click the link um, in the description box for Twitch because I stream more often on, on Twitch than I do on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? But it's a situation where you guys have to understand. This is happening. This is real. Dudes come out and do whatever they want. So you can see we're at a 60 burger right now. We're trying to push for that 100. But this guy, he's such an idiot. Look, look at this guy, bro. He's trying to truck with Mike Vick. This guy does not care, bro. He's really trying to truck with Mike. Then you're going to try champ Bailey the champ, no. Bro, you're going to try to champ, no. Like, the, do me a favor. Guys, understand this because I tried champ in the, in, the, in the recent game. And it went back for six. Champ plays the entire field, all right? I don't know what they did to him and why they souped him up like that. But he plays the entire field. Just so that you guys understand that. Did, he, did Ladder Boy just drop that water? He didn't drop the water from pick? Yo, Ladder, yo, ladder Goat, bro. Yo, Ladder Goat. You're you going to have to, yo, hey. Yo, bro, hey. Pick that. Pick that right quick. Oh, they wouldn't let me jump. So he just fell on the ground like a zombie. All right, that's cool. Uh, now he's going to go for another field goal. Okay, we know how this is going to end. Because this guy couldn't make it like a 20-yarder. So now he's kicking. I don't know what this guy was doing. But it doesn't really matter. It, like, let's not even think about what he was doing. Let's just think about the obvious. Because I know a lot of you guys that watch this video and like this video, You've played a guy that played exactly like this, and the guy beat you by 60 points. And you're wondering to yourself, like, is this, for, is this life? You know what I'm saying? Is this really going on? Like, how is this happening? But it's part of the game, bro. That's why I love it, bro. I used to hate the game, like, two, two minutes ago, but now I like it, bro. Because I know what they're doing to people. They're making everyone hate each other. And it's hilarious because we're falling for the trap. You know what I'm saying? But either way, when you're in the moment, even if you're winning, because I would look, look at you see the score. It was look, the guy's picking the ball, but it's through his body, and he's it's the animation. This game is just so bad. But look, as soon as I get into a game, even if I'm winning like this, 
I'm very angry. And people be like, yo, why is he so mad? He's winning. It's because of the aftermath of just playing games prior, bro. You can't get it out of your system. You just hate your opponent uncontrollably. So don't think that because I was winning this game, I was happy. At no point in this video was I happy, okay? Because Madden does wild things. So if you guessed that we would get a 100 burger, um, I think we're going to get 83, and that's going to be it. I want to thank you guys for watching. I want you guys to know that we're all in the same boat. I want you guys to like and share the video. I want to get this video view go up to about 45,000. And I want to see you guys, all of you, at my next Twitch stream. Uh, check the link in the description. See you guys and girls next time. One love.